Welcome to Ocean Time, I'm Pippa and today I'm talking about clothes. Clothes to pack for a cruise. What to pack and how to pack it. if it can fit into this um, I've already I have one two three four five six pairs of pants for a 10-day cruise I'm thinking that's way too many so I'm going to get rid of the stretch one of the stretchy pants they're gone and we'll see how we go alrighty as you know you always want to roll your clothes up. These travel cubes are awesome. Again, another pair of stretchy pants. I highly recommend it. Fast, fast. Let's see how quick I can pack. Alrighty. My pants are done. Now my tops, again, you've got to mix and match, have layers. I'm not going to do my underwear, I'll leave that somewhere else. <laughs> Roll your clothes up so they don't get creased as much. Uh, this is a skirt, but you can also wear it as a dress, so two for one. Perfect. Let's roll it. I've been getting ready for this video all day. It's very sad that I'm packing for an imaginary cruise. <laughs> this, another beautiful dress. So, very light and easy. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Alrighty. Some more dresses. I probably still have overpacked. We're getting to our swimwear side of things. Don't have to roll the bikini. Nice sun safe shirt, especially if you're in the Caribbean or the South Pacific. And we'll leave that to last. Another multiple ways to wear, so you could wear this as the skirt, as a dress, or as a top, which is in those photos. I've said in another video that having scarves are awesome. So you can still wear a nice dress, but if it's a bit chilly, you've got the scarf that's available. So I always highly recommend taking scarves on board the ship. Whack. A nice cardigan breeze over the top. Um, my pyjamas, my nightie, whack that on top, I whack my ba bathers in there, um, I can always put a bag in there as well, that's from when I worked on the ships, it's so tiny and elegant, full full night, alrighty, 
let's do it and I can even put these in I highly recommend I take three pairs of shoes I take these they're like thongs but they're a bit more dressier nice for formal night nice high heel and I haven't decided which one yet but a pair of boots that I wear on board the ship on the first day so it doesn't take up too much room in my luggage so I'm gonna whack these in there too oh. So, what we have in here are my swimwear, my um, pants, or my shirts, shorts, pair of shoes, some bags. It's heavy, but I'm done for packing. I have some formal dresses that I need to put in. Yes, I have my underwear, so let's just say that works and I'm done in that regards again if you want to take a jacket wear it the day of the cruise wear it with you so you don't have to pack it I quickly want to mention don't forget take a hat if you're coming from Australia you're going to need a European or American plug for any theme nights and uh, this is my reef shoes a family of four reef shoes live in here so it's a shoe bag great way to pack them I will add links below to what you can and can't take on board a cruise ship and what to pack for a cruise ship which is different to this one because this one was all about clothes alrighty um, if you've liked it give me a thumbs up please leave a comment help out our fellow cruisers with any tips that you have and thanks for being on board and see you later